New man dropped out of school aged 12 to caddy at a prestigious golf club, which backed onto his lawn. As a teenager, he struck one of the best balls of his life with borrowed clubs, which earned the support from club members to start his practicing. These led his way all along to beat India's top-ranked amateur in a local match play in recent years, the lifetime chance to leave his shack and the cycle of poverty in Mumbai slums. I didn't choose golf. Golf chose me. My brother, sister and I used to ask for food at people's homes. My father used to drink and was injured in an accident. After his accident, my mother couldn't meet the financial responsibilities alone, so I quit school for working. A new story is not uncommon, and there are high school job out rates across India. Poverty is the biggest factor. financially. When parents themselves are struggling financially, they don't pay attention to their children's education. Instead, the kids are sent to work and earn. While official figures state that 90 percent of Mumbai children are in school, Pratham's own annual surveys find that only 50 to 60 percent of children actually finish school. If we remain illiterate, we will not know the world and look at it in black and white. Anil has gone up in the world, and in an attempt to pay things forward, Anil has pioneered slum golf. Rounds are played in the shanties with plastic balls and crudely fashioned clubs. He taught us all we know about golf, how to hold a club, how to stand, how to focus on the ball. We learned everything from him. But Anil's story is not one of rags to riches, at least not yet. A new coaches and caddies for a living, and right now most of his earnings are plowed directly back into training and tournaments. Playing pro golf requires sponsorship. A new lost his last sponsor over a year ago because of his inability to perform at critical moments. He says playing golf itself doesn't get him anxious, but knowing that his family and parents are depending solely on him has at times become too overwhelming. Sometimes I face extreme difficulties paying for school fees. The other day, my wife asked me, if you ask me family or golf, it's like choosing an eye. I can't choose. I want to see with both eyes. Whatever I underwent, they should not undergo. And if they face it, then what's the point of me having worked so hard? And now I need to stay awake and improve their future.